All right, hey guys, Patrick here in Southwest Fort Worth, and I'm getting ready for the TCA auction that is tomorrow. And so I've been catching some fish. I haven't bagged up anything, but I'm gonna show you a bit of what I've been doing just to prepare what goes into preparing for somebody who's gonna be selling at an auction. And so some of the stuff I've been doing, I got a bunch of the, it's darker now, but I can't even see, but I did get out of here quite a few of the shrimp, but there's quite a few more. I don't think I actually made a, much of a dent. And I got some of the guppies that I have outside and some of these. And I just stopped running the pump. I just have water in it, but there's so much, uh, so much stuff that there's plenty of guppies. And I don't, I don't feed anything out here. They just eats whatever it would naturally eat. There's several vibrant guppies and stuff that I've taken out of these outside tubs and whatnot. And so I'm bringing them with some of the Bozeman eye rainbows and Cribenzies out of that grow out tank that I've got to reseal. That's why it's down like that. It's leaking at a point up there. Um, <clears throat> I am going to be bringing some of the Odessa barbs. I haven't netted any of those yet. And I scooped out some angels. And so, so yeah, when I was prepping, I've also got some of these in class Starburst Endlers. You can see in here, and I'll probably do two trios of them. They're cool. I'll uh, do some of these Odessa barbs. Let's see what else I I start to do. So when when prepping for an auction like this, or or something where you're gonna ship fish or whatever um it's a good idea to go ahead and i just get a bucket of water and fill it up with just regular regular tap water and then i've got the air stone that i just run so that's running i did do a pack of uh this aqua safety chlorinator and conditioner because I got a bunch of it at the last auction and I use uh, safe so I don't really use that that so I brought some to school and well, I got a bunch that's the great part about auctions there's a lot of different giveaways and stuff part of a local club or something do participate in the auctions so what I've done is I've netted out a bunch of the different uh, stuff I'm going to be bagging up. And I'm going to put, uh, I've got this smaller bucket, Home Depot, they sell these around Black Friday, like two and a half gallon or something. But I'm going to put some of that clean water that I got. And here, let me show you. I got these containers, they're cool. I got these for like $2.50 and these strainers for a buck fifty when I was on Guam. But this right here, Here's some of the shrimp that I got from outside. And there were some fish in there too. And then in here I've got some of the rainbows and cribs in there. And then that is all. And that containers some of the guppies from outside. Here's some of the angels. I might, uh, I don't know if I'm gonna do all of them. But there's some of my angels I'm going to bring. Over here we've got uh, some of the gup. Um, so some of the, the guppies and then tangerine shrimp, which I guess are kind of hard to see on this red. But And then those are the N-class endlers that came out of that tank. And then I'll do... A few more things. Um, 
So I've got the bags here. I've got the water I'm going to use. I've already prepped some of the stickers that I'm putting on there. And then I'll, I'll label them as I bag them. Oh, and I'm also going to be netting some of the... Uh, some of the blue bolt shrimp that are in there. Maybe two bags. Um, and it just depends on what goes well at the auction and then what I can like sell more for if I just hold on to it. Uh, but I do want to bring some stuff to the auction, even if it doesn't sell for what I normally sell it for, just because it's, uh, it's nice to contribute to the club. And yeah, people get to have a good de a deal. Uh, that's good too. Um, okay, so... I'm going to be using for this auction, and I'll, I'll, I'll look to have it so you see me bag up a few. But for this auction, I'm going to be using, let me make sure that you can see me over here. Okay. For this auction, I'm going to be using some breather bags. But in the past, I've used regular bags and I've put two thirds water and a third air. And different people tell you different ways to do this. I just want to let you know that there's an Angels Plus article. It's really good on, you know, how they bag their fish. They bag hundreds of fish. And I will put that link in the description uh, so you can see that. I'm just going to do a few fish right now because I want to get this video up tonight and then shoot a video for tomorrow for the auction. So let's do a little fast forward of me bagging up some of these some of these fish. And we'll go ahead and we'll do some of the shrimp. All right, guys, so there we have just three. I've got a bunch more bags to bag up tonight. And I hope to see you tomorrow in Irving for the, um, for the TCA auction. All right, see you.